All right, we're off. Really not looking forward to that, but here we go. Pennsylvania, here we come. Welcome to another vlog. I am currently on my way up to Pennsylvania to visit my friends and family. I'm staying up there for about three weeks and I decided to take this trip now because it's my birthday in two weeks, three weeks. And I'm turning 30 years old, which is so crazy. I'm excited about it. 30 flirty and thriving, am I right? But I was trying to decide for months and months what I wanted to do for my 30th birthday because I don't typically do anything exciting. Like I don't really celebrate my birthdays, but I feel like for 30, like that's a big deal. And I wanted to do something kind of special. I just thought, you know, all I really want to do is just be with my closest friends and just have a good time. So I am renting an Airbnb in the middle of the woods pretty much and I'm having a little party and I'm very excited. I'll be doing that in two weeks and the rest of the time I'm just gonna visit my family and see everybody. But I am currently about halfway there just crawling along in DC traffic, love that. But yeah, I just wanted to pop on here and say hello and give you an update and let you know what's going on. I'm gonna try to vlog this trip as much as I can while also like still being in the moment and enjoying it, you know? Also, I'm very excited because my parents know that I'm planning on coming up for my birthday, but they don't realize that I'm staying as long as I am and I did not tell them that I'm coming today. They think I'm still not coming for like another week or two. I'm just gonna show up and surprise them and that should be really fun. I'm here for my package. Who's here? What the fuck are you doing here? Oh, it's a surprise? What are you doing here? What are you doing? And I just saw him. And I was gonna call you when the It's a couple weeks later. We have a little bit of catching up to do. Um, so first of all, before I forget, I know I just like randomly appeared with a septum piercing and didn't say anything about it. I had wanted this really, really badly like 10 years ago when I was in college. I don't know, I chickened out. I never ended up doing it because I didn't know how I was gonna like it on myself. And then recently I was thinking about doing it randomly one day while I was still in North Carolina just literally went into the piercing shop by myself spontaneously was not planning on getting it pierced that day so I didn't vlog it or anything I definitely like how it looks better when I have makeup on and I'm like all done up I've been in PA for two weeks now and I've just been trying to see my friends as much as possible it sucks because the weather has been so shitty since I've been up here there's been a handful of like nice days but for the most part it's been kind of cold and a lot a lot of rain so 
a lot of my days have been spent just inside. I watched season four, part one of Stranger Things. Oh my God, so good. I can't wait for the last part to come out. So it kind of sucks not really being able to go out and do very much, but at the same time, I feel like it's nice to just have a little bit of a break and just, you know, take time off and just be like on vacation mode. I will say though, I thought that being here would feel like super nostalgic and it has it. I mean, it's beautiful up here, don't get me wrong. Um, and I'm so happy to see my friends and family, but I don't know, like the whole time I've been up here, it's just been making me really appreciate where I live in North Carolina so much. And I keep thinking like, I wish all my friends and family would just come down there because then it would be perfect. Cause I miss all of them and I love them, but I don't miss this area. At least not yet, you know? My allergies have also been terrible my hair's been super super dry and like really tangly which i feel like is probably because of the water too because um my parents have well water definitely enjoying my trip and making the most of it but i'm not gonna lie i i miss wilmington i kind of think if there was anything like eventful that happens I don't think so but i'm currently at an airbnb and it is just so freaking cute it's in the middle of nowhere in the woods like the dirt road getting up here as you saw was so narrow and terrifying but i booked this place for the weekend and i'm having a bunch of my friends come over tomorrow and we're gonna grill and just hang out drink play music have a good old time and i wanted some place that would be like secluded so we could just enjoy ourselves and not like disturb anyone it's really cute here though and it's like so aesthetic like the way they have everything decorated it's so cute there's a lot of plants inside so i'm excited hopefully we can get like some nice pictures while we're here too um it's my 30th birthday on tuesday but let me show you a little tour of this house i literally just got here I didn't even bring my bags inside yet. So this is the front of the house. It has this really nice wrap around porch. So we have some seating over here. And then this is the entryway. There's a little living room that opens up to the kitchen. I just love the decor in here. It's very much my style. It's so freaking cute in all of the skylights. I love it. And then down in here, there's the bathroom. I love this. And then over here, we have some bunk beds. There's like a loft one all the way up there. I kind of want to go look. Actually, this isn't a bed. It's just the top. So, never mind. You come up here and just hang out and read, I guess. <laughs> There's some books over there. Oh my god. This is terrifying. Then there's a bedroom over here. I love the ceilings. Oh, there's a light up here. Ugh, there we go. Closets. Oh my God, with robes. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Definitely gonna be putting those on later. And then there's another Bedroom over here. More robes. We love to see it. <laughs> and then out here, there's the swinging bench that I was just sitting on. There's a bunch of string lights all over in the backyard here. So I cannot wait to turn those on later. More seating over here, little table. And then it wraps around back to the front. Yeah, look at all these string lights. These are gonna be so cute. 
little table down here. I haven't come to check out down here yet. This is the most exciting part. Hot tub! Oh my god. I cannot wait to go in here. Look how cute it looks from the back. Adorable. And then there's a fire pit over here. This is going to be super fun. And then this is the little grill. Yeah, look how nice. It's like so serene. And there are houses like back there because I passed a bunch on my drive up here, but you can't see them at all or hear anything from here. So super private which is exactly what i wanted so i'm really happy about that this is gonna be so nice julia my friend who i do my podcast with is on her way to meet me she's gonna stay here with me tonight we're just gonna hang out make some drinks we're doing an instagram live on our podcast page i'm excited for her to get here it's so nice but i feel like as soon as it gets dark it's gonna be really freaking creepy so uh I definitely don't want to be here by myself. Okay. Yeah, because I didn't even think about that and I haven't had anything to eat since like breakfast time, so. Okay, bye. Bye. So before I came up here, I stopped at the store and I got a few things. Like I got paper plates and napkins and cups and stuff like that for tomorrow. And then I also got a couple things for tomorrow morning when we wake up. Half and half for our coffee, of course, and orange juice to make mimosas with. And I got a bag of coffee. We got some cinnamon bread. But I was not thinking about dinner tonight. So I was just talking to Julia. She's about a half hour away, she said. And she's going to try to see if she can find something. Because my entire drive up here was like all back roads. And I did not pass anything. Like it was all just woods and like a few houses. And we're planning on drinking and doing our Instagram live and all that when she gets here. Like I said. Uh, so yeah, we definitely should eat something. But. Got. <laughs> All the alcohol. Forgot food, but didn't forget the alcohol, of course. So we got some vodka. We have some champagne for our mimosas in the morning. We have some knockoff Kahlua and some knockoff Baileys. You know what that means. Espresso martinis. Although I don't have espresso. But I can make regular coffee to put in it or just skip the coffee altogether and that's fine. So yeah, I am just gonna wait for her to get here, I guess. I'm trying to decide which bedroom I wanna take. I think I'll do this one because it feels cooler. Yeah, this room definitely feels cooler. I kinda like that it has those shelves over there that I could put my stuff on, but I'm gonna let Julia take that room. You know, she gets hot very easily and I get cold very easily, so I think this room will be better. Oh, here she is. Hello! I haven't seen your new car yet. Very nice. A little two tone action. Wow. Amazing. Um, do you have a lot of stuff? Do you want me to grab anything? I have a lot of stuff. <laughs> okay, first things first. Most importantly. Hello. <laughs> <gasps> wow! Oh my god, I'm so excited. Wow. Yay! They're fucking huge. Oh my god. Hey, thank you. I'm so excited. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll just I'll just grab this stuff for now. I'm I'm gonna make. Ugh. I'll just. Make it. Too bad I wasn't recording that. <sighs> Hit the ceiling fan. No. no. <laughs> I made it all the way up here. 
Oh sorry. God, what? <laughs> I can't believe it. Too oh my God. Two se yeah, I know. No. no. <laughs> Tragic. It's a big ass hole. Tape Maybe. Oh God. This one will just not float. Yeah, well, we. Well, if there's tape, we could tape it to the wall. Oh, no. Are you. Oh my God. Wow. All right. Well. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That's Just an O. Oh my god. You can have a super sauce. Yes! A ginormous <laughs> martini. I can open it now. Okay. My idea was like, so it's like, I'll do 30 little gifts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yes. I Maybe mean, this will be my outfit tomorrow. <laughs> I wasn't sure what I was gonna wear, but now I know. <gasps> yes, karaoke I, microphone. I was like, you didn't we just use it this weekend? I know, like, literally. Well, no, you know that I will use this all the time. I thought it was something you might need. On a regular basis, even when I'm just like home alone <laughs> oh, for the rest of the games. It has a voice changer too. Oh hell so yeah! That's gonna be fun. I absolutely will be using that. That's like a practical adult. Oh, bit. dishcloth. I love those. Like, Cute. Like, your counters with them. Wow, eco-friendly. Yeah, where you go friendly you. now. That's a little candle. Candle. Ooh. I got that from Zoom my listen. local Albany store. What is it called? Pork orange. Oh, a box. Ooh. Mmm. Pretty nice. Oh, good. Scent. It smells so good. There's too much in here. Yeah, I love like it. it. Oh, wow. Oh, does it? Amazing. Does it? Is that a magnet? No. Oh. I don't think so. I no, was like, perfect really like fridge it. thing, and then I realized it didn't have a magnet. Oh my god. I love. <laughs> Cozy socks. Best in the world. But you have to be careful when you wash them, because I ruined mine. For more, oh. like, drying them. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like a sleep mask, <gasps> but they came out with a new one. Oh my god! And you don't have to use your finger, it has a spatula that you put inside. You know what's so funny is I literally was gonna get another sleeping mask. <gasps> Wait, how do you open this? Now I don't need to. Oh, let me just try that. Yeah. Gotcha. Ooh. And then a little spatula Ooh. right there. Oh my god, Laneige new lip product. Is this the spatula? Yes, yeah, right in the lid. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, it's like so buttery. Yeah. God, I needed this literally right now because my lips are so dry. Perfect timing. Mm. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> I have to open my card. Oh my god, sushi. <laughs> Amazing. What do I want to put in the So cute. Thank you. Oh my god. So sweet and thoughtful. Yeah. But like there's Sam's car, there's mine, there's nothing else. Yeah, there's I think there's a house. There's like, literally oh, nothing oh, there. Hey! We're vlogging. Oh. Hi. <laughs> we made our drinks. Oh my god, I just slid. Ah! We made our drinks. I have my ginormous espresso martini. Hi vlog. And we're Instagram living. <laughs> it's like an option. <laughs> it's now 12, what time is it? At like 12.30 at least, maybe later. We were planning on going on Instagram live for like an hour. <laughs> we ended up being on there for almost four. Like we just kept it going. It was, everybody was just hanging out with us all night. It was a good time. We got these balloons blown up. We had Bitch I'm a Gemini, I had my little photo shoot, we took pictures, and then Julia wanted pictures with just Bitch, which is hilarious. They came, we got the best I picture. Like we should do it in the, in the robe. <laughs> we should, we be. Yeah. We should, well we, we could set up the camera right now real quick, or the, set up our phones. In the room. And we could put the timer on. I just don't know where we would, I guess we could put it up there. Probably. 
Yeah. That would With the yeah, both of us? Yeah, we should do that. We should for the chat. Real quick. Well, because we have our makeup done all nice, you know? We literally, like, I got ready. I did full face of makeup. Um, literally just for the one picture. Oh, perfect pictures. I wanted to do my pictures with the 30, but oh as you gosh. know, yeah. So hopefully my brother, I asked him if he would get, pick up a three tomorrow on his way up here. But yeah, I finished. I had, where'd my martini glass go? I had this entire martini glass filled with an espresso martini and I drank the whole thing. Yes, sir. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna need to eat some cold stale fries. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> just hiccups. Hold your breath. Hold your breath and count backwards from 100. 100. <laughs> oh no. Does that scare you? <laughs> okay, but now we are in our bathing suits and our robes. And we're gonna hit up the hot tub we're finally. Hot tub. I'm very excited. I love how we have done like nothing really all night, but it's been so fun. <laughs> Ooh, it's chilly. This is like perfect. This is literally, yeah, this is perfect. You and me, we can drink too much. Yeah, we could. This is like end of the night, like everyone's just like. We're having our coffee and we're about to make some mimosas. Look at us in our robes. Yeah. We went, oh yeah, I, I recorded that. We went in the hot tub last night for a bit. We look like a couple on a spa <laughs> trip. Yeah. I love it though. This is the exact same Ikea robe that I have at this home. This is a great basic robe. Yeah. Yeah. It covers everything because it's like a nice towel-y material so put and it on right after you shower. You know sometimes you go to a hotel, well at least for me, you go to a hotel and their robe is like teeny tiny. Not here. A good size. Full coverage. Yeah. Ten out of ten. I love it, and I feel like I'm at home. Yep. Love. Oh. We're just chilling, and then we're gonna go out to the store, get some food to make later. We need to kind of straighten up a little bit. We need to get better tape. For <laughs> that's what's our wall. left. Yeah, that's what's because left of the balloons. Yeah. I, I know, I definitely want to put the whole thing. It should be up whenever, like, for the Up, uh, yeah. And then for the I blew this up too <laughs> last night. So this has to, we gotta put that somewhere. Yeah, it's a very nice, peaceful morning. Mm -hmm. Beautiful sunny day. Thank God. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Yum. That's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> is all that's left of the bitch I'm a Gemini wall. It's Sunday afternoon. Well, like Sunday evening now at this point. Honestly, I don't even know what footage I got yesterday. I know I didn't really pull the camera out very much. I think most of the footage I got was just on my phone and like on my Instagram story. <coughs> I can't wait to get back down south because of my allergies, oh my God. But it was a really, really fun weekend. It's still not over. I still have one more night here, so I'm gonna 
try to make the most of it and enjoy it and just have like a nice peaceful night to myself. When I got here on Friday, I was like, eh, it's a little creepy. It's like in the middle of nowhere, but it's just so peaceful and I'm honestly looking forward to just having the alone time and it being like completely quiet because since I've gotten up here, I've, I haven't been completely alone at all the entire time. I'll put a link to this Airbnb in the description. The girl that owns this place actually has a few different Airbnbs in the area. Each house is just so cute and so unique and I love her style and they're all kind of like in the middle of the woods, like super secluded. So if you're just looking for a nice peaceful getaway, highly recommend and she's been a really great host. But yeah, I cleaned up everything in the backyard put everything away out there. And I just need to take down those balloons and then I sell a bunch of stuff in the kitchen and in my bedroom. But for the most part, it's pretty clean in here. So I'm gonna watch The Time Traveler's Wife on HBO because a new episode came out today. And then I'm gonna pack up all my stuff in the morning and head out of here. And then I'm gonna go back to my parents' house for a couple more days. My actual birthday is on Tuesday. Um, my mom took the day off of work, so we are going to spend the day together and then Wednesday I am driving down to Philly and I'm staying with my friend Kayla and then Thursday morning I'm gonna head back down to North Carolina that's my plan for the rest of the week I'm gonna enjoy my peaceful night and uh, hopefully nothing creepy happens hello it is Friday morning. I finally got back to my apartment in North Carolina yesterday. It was rough. So Wednesday, I drove down to Philly to spend a few hours with my friend and stay over at her place. And I thought, you know, Philly is on my way. So that'll cut out like two hours from my 10 hour drive back home. When I was leaving, it said that my timing was gonna be good. There wasn't a lot of traffic. Thought everything was going to be fine but there ended up being tons of traffic and then between having to stop for bathroom breaks and for gas and all of that it still ended up taking me 10 hours so needless to say by the time i got back here yesterday i was just done all i wanted to do was take a shower which i did it felt amazing and lay on the couch and watch the kardashians and then go to sleep so that's exactly what i did by nine o'clock I was in bed asleep. It feels really good though to be back. The weather feels so nice. It is so warm. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap up this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much for all of the birthday love that I received on Instagram and to all of my friends who came and hung out with me last week. I love you guys so much. I had so much fun, but I am really excited to get back to real life and work and a normal routine. So I will see you guys really soon in my next video. Bye.